Pope Francis has accepted the resignation of Bishop Richard Malone of Buffalo. He released a letter this morning. I have concluded after much prayer and discernment that the spiritual welfare of the people of the Diocese of Buffalo will be better served by a new bishop who perhaps is better able to bring about the reconciliation, healing and renewal that is so needed. The resignation comes just weeks after Bishop Nicholas DiMarzio concluded his Vatican-appointed visitation to Buffalo to examine mounting allegations of clergy sex abuse and a possible cover-up. However, in his letter this morning, Bishop Malone said that the fact-finding mission had little to do with his decision to resign. Inevitably, some will surmise that my decision is the result of the recently completed apostolic visitation carried out by Bishop Nicholas DiMarzio at the behest of the Holy See. While I was made aware of the general conclusions of the report, which were a factor in my discernment, my decision to retire early was made freely and voluntarily. Also Wednesday morning, Bishop DiMarzio released a statement in part saying, this has been a difficult period in the life of the church in Buffalo. As part of this apostolic visitation, we spoke with more than 80 people over a period of several weeks to gather information for this administrative review. It was conducted with urgency as the Holy See directed that this visitation be thorough, with the foremost consideration being the good of the people of the Diocese of Buffalo. My family just got a little bigger. The Vatican has appointed Bishop Edward Scharfenberger as the Apostolic Administrator of Buffalo until a permanent replacement is named. Thank you. Thank you so much. In a news conference on Wednesday, Bishop Scharfenberger said that he has known since the beginning of November that he was being considered for the role. I received a call from the Apostolic Nuncio, Bishop Pierre, Christophe Pierre, that uh, I was being considered as uh, a possible appointee, uh, as, as Apostolic Administrator, and that uh, he would take that to the Holy Father. A native of Brooklyn, Bishop Scharfenberger was ordained a priest of the Diocese of Brooklyn in the 1970s. The new apostolic administrator promising transparency and to do a lot of, quote, listening and learning. People in Buffalo calling for this resignation ever since details emerged about a hidden list of accused priests and secret phone recordings. The crisis escalating when his executive assistant leaked documents to the press. I hope we're not going to have to do a lot more protesting. I mean, we really don't want to. I, I know people seem to think that we really enjoy this, but we don't. Bishop Malone, who has led Buffalo since 2012, had resisted numerous calls from clergy, seminarians, and lay leaders in the diocese to step down. My heart just goes out to you. Bishop Scharfenberger says he hopes this marks a new beginning for the Diocese of Buffalo. I would like every parish to, to be an oasis of security where people can come home, and nobody feels left out. Emily Druby, Currents News. If you're watching Currents News on YouTube, be sure to hit the subscribe button and then click on the bell to get instant updates about all of our newest content because we are putting your faith in the news.